under IFTA settings, you can adjust your units of measurement you would like to use when entering and reporting your information, such as miles versus kilometers, and you can also select whether you will use odometer entries or trip sheets when entering your mileage. If you have any questions, you can click Help Me Choose so you can learn a little more about the difference between entering odometer entries and using the trip sheet option. So here you can see that I've chosen odometer entries, and for measuring units, we have gallons, miles, and pounds. At the bottom, there's a section called Other Settings. Here you can select if you would like to allow driver records within your IFTA account. And if you do allow driver records, you can select if you would like to allow the fuel records to be entered without necessarily having the driver details as well. And another service that Express IFTA offers is a state adjacency check. After you enter your mileage or odometer readings, Express IFTA will perform a state adjacency check to make sure that you don't miss any states that were driven in during that quarter. After selecting your IFTA settings, you can click Save at the bottom to update your information. And if you do have any questions while filing your IFTA return, you can give us a call. Our US-based support center is located in Rock Hill, South Carolina, and you can reach us by phone at 704-234-6005, or send us an email to support at expressifta.com.